Our new Tesla's due for a tire rotation, and I've always done my own tire rotations, and I don't see why it should be any different for our Tesla. So I picked up these jacking pucks for the Tesla. In case you don't know, a Tesla, when you jack it up, there are certain jacking points, and to protect the battery, they recommend using these pucks. They're not strictly necessary, but they are a good way to protect your investment. So I got these, and one of the first things I noticed about them, which I think is awesome, is that Unlike many sets of Tesla pucks that I've read the reviews for, these don't stink. I, I don't smell these at all. I mean, I, I smell them if I get right up to them, but otherwise they don't have an overwhelming, I think I've heard it described as like a petroleum smell. And these don't have that at all. So I'm very pleased with that. They've got this great little case that we can actually just keep in our car in case of a roadside emergency or if we have to take the car someplace where they don't have their own pucks. I really hope that never happens, but just in case we can store these in the car. So this case is fantastic for that. So otherwise, they're just basic. They're, they just pop into the little hole there and then you can put your jack right under them. They can be used on all models of Tesla, 3, Y, S, X, probably even the Cybertruck, although I haven't actually seen any indications that the Cybertruck also has the same style jacking points, but it stands to reason that it would. Yeah, so there's not really much more to them than that. So the only thing left to do really is to Go check them out. Okay, so it's been a few days since I did the tire rotation. Everything went swimmingly for the most part. Nothing that wasn't my own fault. And uh, they came through very well, uh, relatively unscathed. I can see a little circle here from the jack, uh, but they didn't really deform under pressure or anything like uh, some reviews of some uh, different pucks have said these came through just fine. The only thing that happened, and this is 100% on me, is that this one got a little deformed when I tried to use my old jack in addition to my new jack. My new jack has a cup that is exactly the right size to fit these. My old jack was not. It was an old school jack with a small little cup there and a, just a smaller jack. I tried to use it in addition to my new jack. And because that jack didn't actually cup it entirely, it actually was down underneath. It did cut into this puck a little bit. So that is something to note. If you have a jack that doesn't, that the pucks don't fit into like a cradle, then you might want to get something to, uh, to make that more flush. But otherwise that that's completely on me. And all of the ones that I used in the new jack that does cup them worked perfectly. So if you got a good jack, you're going to be fine. And in the end, I don't have any complaints about these at all. I think that these are going to work fantastic for doing future tire rotations. And we're going to keep these in the back of the Tesla and have them just in case we ever need them for an emergency. See, and I'll pull them out every time I need to do a tire rotation. I think these are going to work out great and I'm very happy with them. I would recommend them. So I hope this helps.